Cassell guarding Peyton up tight. They give it to Malone on top. Garnett has him. Irvin Johnson will try to control Shaq. Not this time. No hesitation by the big fella. Remember, it's just a little bit after 6 o'clock local time. From the corner, wide open. Gary Payton hits his first shot. And he was too wide open. That play was not one at the game two loss. Here's O'Neal. Payton for three. Lakers. And he hits. Doing a terrific job of surprise me if uh, Green Rush a little bit dazed. Carl Malone makes nice fake and strong take. The Lakers lead by seven. Largest lead of the game. So Candy had a great game offensively in game one. I think he got something like 10 points. He did. And uh, didn't he go for the donut in game two? He did. And right there, Shaq scores easily over him. The Lakers lead by nine. Kobe Bryant's been quiet. He has. Kate enters for Shaq. Great position. Count the hoop. The foul will go against Oliver Miller. The basketball. Look how deep he is when he catches. That's... <laughs> You're in deep trouble if he catches it that deep. Now, all Oliver Miller should have done on that was... Ed Bedenko. Now they swing to the other side. Shaq will take it straight down the lane. How about the quickness? Hello, Kenny just doesn't have the strength to match up with Shaq. Shaq kicks it out for Peyton. Peyton, the drive. And it's the runner. What a night for Gary Payton. Lakers are doing a great, great thing here in terms of... Look, oh, he's on the board. Yeah. That's what I think what Flick Saunders is arguing about. Yet Kobe takes two free throws. Yeah, I don't buy that call at all. I mean, Kobe's still looking for his first basket from the field today. But again, only is taking three shots. Yeah. Block on that. Jack pitches back to Kobe. Now screens for him. Slips it and goes down to the block. Across to Devin George. Has shot with confidence tonight and hits again. This is Carl Malone. Back out for Kobe Bryant. Still looking for his first basket from the field. And he hits from deep in the corner. A set. Gave him a gift on the next possession. Carl Malone has it high. Enters down low for O'Neal. Four. He wolves around him. And a foul. No, they're going to count the hoop. Went up through the basket. Take a look here. Shaq so deep. Goes up. And Olo Kendi is, is coming up through the basket. Going over to double Shaq and getting a piece of that ball. Well, Kobe crossing over between two defenders. Hits the pull up. Now, that to is a five a, point game. Such a good move. The players to <laughs> shooting specialist. Well, let's see if Shaq can get off this over from the free throw line. Not this time. Oh, yes. Oh. I called it too soon. The height, no, the, the Nelson bounce. Kirby X, second straight, good game off the bench, 13 points. And he's got the Laker lead down to two. O'Neal makes it four and will go to the line for a three-point play. Inside out, get it to Shaq, realizing that there's a serious mismatch there with Ola with Candy. And Shaq just taking it strong to the basket, gets the nice shooting proportions. <laughs> The fifth offensive rebound of the night for Shaquille O'Neal of his 13. Well, uh, the T-Wolves counter with a guy who's maybe even need to make that call. Brian back at the line. Doesn't have a rebound tonight. Some momentum, but they, they're unable to score in that possession. Kobe into the lane. It's a pull-up. Not a good interchange for the T-Wolves. Passed up. Fisher gets the Lakers into their set quickly. Kobe back to Fisher. It's a three on the way. He's got it. The lead is up to eight. And again, and I'm belaboring the point, but I try to keep him out of that low block position. Or you have to side him, front him, give him different looks. If you stay behind him, it's too easy. Bill O'Neal in a post-up situation. He catches it. He's already got a foot in the paint. And now Madsen doesn't know which way he's going to go because Shaq has that drop step to the baseline. Now he takes it into the middle and is able to score. And you know that commercial that's out where the big guy scores easily on the little guy and he just says, 
Too little. Too Hudson. Four on Ola Candy. Two on Madsen. That's a really good position, and the Lakers are going to him. Yeah, he is just tirelessly going after it, working down low, going after it. And a nice play there, following Shaq early. So the Shaq did not have an opportunity to make a shot. There's a rarity. And uses it there to get by Zerbia. They're going to get Oliver Miller with a foul as he came over to help out. He has three now. 12 points in the second half, most coming from the free throw line. Early and often. One of two on that trip. Tonight. Yes, he has. Quick ball movement gets it down for O'Neal. Back out of the double team. Open on top is Kobe. Oh, that's just beautiful execution on the offensive end for the Lakers. And there you go. And they find Kobe wide open. That time, Zerbiak had it partially blocked by O'Neal. The Lakers are running. Kobe. That's a three. Hello. Good night. Lock. It forces the defense to anticipate that you're going there, and it creates an awful lot of wide open. Better at home in the playoffs. And he's, he's more assertive in the last couple of minutes. I think he's felt he's feeling more comfortable on the floor in the last couple of Hassel was in the game early on, hasn't been in the game lately. When you're 6 of 19 from the free throw line, it's a pretty good strategic move until he lips like Hackershaw. It doesn't. Crowd loves it every time Shaquille sinks the free throw. They answered the call and reestablished their, their position in this series. Well, Kevin Garnett and the Timberwolves could not repeat the energetic performance of game number two.